Oh. Did I do it? Yes. I'm tired though. No, do it. You just got that. That was first tee. No. The f is going on, guys? <laughs> We're at Mount High right now. We just got another dumping of snow over the weekend, so we wanted to seize the opportunity to ride further into the season. Very excited. A thousand percent energy today, guys. Shout out to everyone that was uh, comment commented on the last video. I was really supportive. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. <laughs> Go for it. Flat base. Keep your knees bent. You're still on your back leg. I seen it before you took off. These are my new, my new thing. A little bit of natural caffeine in the morning gets me up and going. What do you think of these, Rachel? Nasty. Why? I don't know. I'm drinking any more water. First chair of the day. This is the earliest I've ever been up at Mountain High. It's like 9:30 a.m. The chair opened half an hour ago. I forced Rachel to get straight on the big chair because she's like, let's just do the little one. I was like, no, nah, let's just get straight on the big one because it's like, there's still, it's still groomed. So she'll get to experience kind of first tracks in a way. But look, look how groomed it is. It usually looks like that. Oh, did you cop that in the face? And then if you look over there, that's a high desert. They moved all the stuff around in Mountain High, but there was like a tube I was really comfy with when they had it down there. They moved it up to here. So I'm going to hike this a couple times. There's a few things I really want to do. I want to get a 50-50, front 50-50, front board, and I really want to get a backboard slide. I'm going to have to, I might have to walk back up a little bit to get a little more speed, I think. Okay. All right. Yeah, Wish me luck, everybody. I'm actually like scared to do this, so. It's on his head. Comment below if you want to see me do this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try and go for front board this time. I'm actually like half scared. <laughs> I'm trying to just like, you know, get comfy being scared is what Dan says. Like training yourself to be better at being the mental wall. Like train yourself to be in front of the mental wall a bit better. All right here. Oh, I can't see. I was trying to look in the right camera. Right here. Guess me up. Come on. Oh, okay. Come on. Come on. Right here. You got it. <laughs> Let's go. I was like, what are we doing? <laughs> that was almost it. I think I need to concentrate on like when I'm in the front board, look over my shoulders because I'm very much looking at the feature and I just need to like get on the feature and like cock my head then my shoulders follow so I can get out. This is the most scary part of the day for me. So I feel like getting this out of the way, I'll feel more chill and I won't have that anxiety hanging over my head. It's like, this is snowboarding at least. Like going to skate the park, if you're like trying to learn something, I guess you'd feel anxious and nervous about it too. But I'm more familiar with feeling anxious and nervous skateboarding. Cause I can just kick my board out and hop off in the air and just run out of it. This, there's no, there's no getting out of this. Like I'm strapped in, so I have to like be committed all the way. I guess that's why some snowboarders make really good skateboarders. The commitment. Ooh. I feel like my problem on that last one or the one before this was I wasn't allowing myself enough time to get off the lip in the air and then turn. I was like trying to get on straight away. So I feel like the key here is like pop let your board get up and then turn it and get it on. Um, I feel like I could have gotten out of it a bit better. Like I was still kind of facing inwards when I got off, I need to open my shoulders up a bit more, but that's not bad. I've never really front boarded a feature like this before. So I'll try to go for another one just to make it two to be true. And I'll try to go for the backboard. I feel more scared about the backboard. I think I just need to remember let it get up and then put it down. Oh. <laughs> That was worse. That was better. That was better. I gotta go for backboard now, and that's quite scary. <laughs> I'm just gonna try, like, like I said, come in hillside, and then just let the board get up and out, and then get on, and lean forward. I don't land on my ass. All right. <laughs> Tell us what happened. What? It's 
fucking scary. I shouldn't be scared of this. Why am I so scared? You look good. I keep forgetting to get up and then get on. I keep thinking, ready? See, he's like calm about getting up and getting on. Thinking about it was scarier than doing it. I feel like once I got up and over, I was, I was, I was like half committed and you could see my legs were kind of straight. So this next one I'm gonna to try to do is try to keep my, be like conscious about keeping my knees bent and keeping my body weight forward. They reckon when you backboard on a snowboard, you're supposed to be like, you're supposed to like put your hand out towards the end of the rail. Mm, mm -hmm. I thought they looked good. It was okay. I could have gone to fake you. Should I try it? Yeah. I reckon I can go to fakie out of that board. My my shoulders are open up all the way. I feel like I could have gotten to fakie. See how we go. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what I did wrong, Rachel. I think you just need to land more confidently in your switch and just go straight rather than what I do on the jumps. I need to come in while I'm in the board slide. I need to commit to coming out fakie because I was still yes, trying to like I'll wait to the end. Like I need to be in the board slide and think. Coach. No problem. Much better. <laughs> that felt cool. You know, the more I'm good. learning about snowboarding is the snowboard will do half the work for you because it's so large and stable and there's a it's like a triangle like this. Skateboard the triangle is kind of like this. Yeah. So I feel like your weight is dispersed. I didn't have to do shit. All I had to do is bring my knees, turn my shoulders, let the board go. And then commit to turning my shoulders on camera. Look, look, look. Oh, you missed it. These fucking kids. Kids are sending it? Yeah. I just seen homeboy that pulled through. He did a back blunt to fakey. Back blunt, you're on your rear foot, you're back winding. I kind of want to give it a go. Worst as it comes to worst, it's just going to go on your board to fakey. So, now, nah, should I do it? Yes. I'm tired though. No, do it. You're right. young. Fucking this is do for it. me trying to be more proactive making content. So, I hope you guys appreciate <laughs> me really getting out of my comfort zone right here. Fuck off. You Fuck just fucking got that. That was first tee. That was first tee. Was second. I over my back binding? I have to look at the video. Looks fucking good though. Fuck off. <laughs> that was, if I was over my back binding, that was blunt to fake you first fucking try. Fucking hell. The fuck is going on guys? <laughs> that was literally first try. And I kind of had a rough idea of how I should put my weight. I was like, I'm just going to go come up like board slide, but shift my weight back towards my back foot and let my rear binding catch slide it and then just turn out and that was first fucking tee and hell yeah i've thought about this trick many times before like I've, i think about snowboard tricks sometimes and i was like i reckon i could probably do it and i just fucking did it <laughs> i don't know if you guys i hope that proves something to you i'm pumped like i feel like snowboarding is relative to skateboarding in the way is if you have a few tricks skateboarding they translate into other tricks and i feel like snowboarding is the same but less the learning curve is a lot shorter so yeah hell thank yeah. you rachel for pumping Woo -woo. That. I'll be really nice to you the rest of the day. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank <great>. God. <laughs> oh, that would oh, be bad. <laughs> I honestly feel so accomplished today. Like, on the lifts up, I was looking at this feature and I was like, mm, yeah, maybe. And it's it's like perfectly groomed here still. The other day, yesterday when we came, it was already all chopped up and shitty. And I remember trying to get on a front 50 and I fucked up. But today it's like perfect and I'm like, let's just get out the way. So then the rest of the day, I can just ride. And rest of the day, Rachel can eat shit on the deck. She's Rachel's gonna try. Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. here is gonna try for a, a good ollie off the kicker. Oh, stop it. I sound like you guys, huh? <laughs> right. You wish. There's a drop right over here I'm really trying to get Rachel to do. Go to here. Yeah, where I'm pointing. This is a drop right here. All you gotta do, get your board straight, come in, and you got it. Do a little. You could probably still go from there. We out here. Get your board straight. Go to the right of the sign. Yep. Okay. Here we go, we're gonna get a power slide spray. That's a good one. Get it straight. Yeah. Oh, this kid's about to get stuck. 
All right, we're at the jump line. We're running it back. Hello, Sunnies. And for the 10th time. Eveningmob.com. Okay. Pops, So, Revelation, bend your knees. Bend my knees. I'm going to, I'm going to, do you want me to, do you want me to coach you or just let you do it? I don't fucking know. Just do it. Bend your knees. Get your ass to the grass. Bend your knees. Bend, 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 bend. See? That was better. Next one. Get low. Really suck your legs up this time, okay? Right here. Go. You need to go straight now. We're gonna lose speed. Just go, just go, just go. Ben, get low, get low, get low. Right here. You're jumping more solid. She's jumping way more solid up since I told her Ben to ask the grass. Wrapping up the day right now, it's about 2 p.m. but it is slushy like to the point whereas you get to the bottom of the hill and you're fighting the snow because it just wants to grip. Um, I think I got sunscreen in my eye, it feels sore. He was crying on the Yeah, Rachel got a bit sunburnt. No, I think it was good. Um, yeah, productive day for all of us. I'm stoked I got that. For all two of us. Yeah, it was good. It was good. We're out here walking the dog. And uh, Rachel just pointed out this footprint here. I said it was a big coyote, but to give you some size reference, she reckons it's a mountain lion. I could be so wrong. I reckon it's a big coyote. Coyote? It could be a bobcat, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe a panther. What do you reckon, Bane? You reckon yeah, it's a... Look at my paws. That's what a coyote's yeah. paws look like. We're in the bush over here. And yeah, walking the dog. I got sunburnt, as you guys can see. I'm all crisped up. I look like Kenny Powers. Had a lot of fun on the mountain today. I feel like we both, Rachel and I, got some stuff we wanted to do. And I'm really stoked on that um, back blunt 180 out. I was thinking next time I might try front blunt 270 out. I feel like I can spin backside quicker and easier than I can spin front side. Because back blunt front 270 out would be sick. But I feel like front work a bit easier for me. We got more of these big footprints. You reckon it's a horse? Yeah, no, wait, look. There's... <laughs> Is there's, it a horse? There's <laughs> footprints next to it. I think it's someone's truck. Someone's it. dog. Big, Huge ass. big, uh, what do you call them? Um, like a King Corso. King like Corso mastiff, dog, yeah. Or... Something like that. Wow. Look at that amazing. sunset. What a beautiful day. Southern California. Red, I want you to go to his house. Blow that joint up. Don't let nobody out. Oh, get trigger, man. Bring him to me. Cause I'm tired of this trigger, man. Stuff in Tennessee. Now all the time while this stuff is going on. I called up another roadie on my flip phone. Junior, I want you to call.